Hello, my name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an addiction recovery coach, a life coach, a minister, and the host of this show, The Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version is if you go to YouTube under our channel, Take Your Life Back Today show, you can see us iHeartRadio, iTunes, Google Music, Amazon Music, and other digital platforms available to you in your area. Yes, you may have big obstacles in your path that, uh, you, you know, you can't overcome on your own. The good news is, as a follower of Christ, you're not on your own. You have the most powerful force uh, in the universe on your side. When he speaks, things happen. Remember that. Sometimes the hardest part uh, of the promise is being patient. None of us have a lot of patience. Things might not happen when you want them to happen, but trust that God will let it happen when he wants it to happen. It's supposed to happen when he wants it. So let me encourage you to go of what was and have faith in what will be. God has more for you than uh, what was behind you in the past. You weren't created to live in fear. You were created to live in victory. Stay persistent in your faith, prayers, and praise, and patience. If you're going to receive the promises of God, you have to trust in his timing in your life and not rush things. Even when you can't feel God, he is still with you as you're sitting or watching me or listening to me. And may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Romans 15:13. Listen, folks, call me at 844-405-HELP. Together, you and I, we you can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. Remember, simple smile to anyone can change their day and you make a difference in your day. I'm sitting here somewhere in New Jersey at one of those rest stops at 1.30 in the morning on our way to New York to pick up some a friend of ours to head right back down to Virginia. I look, look a little disheveled this morning, but that's okay. The message was clear, and we'll talk to you guys tomorrow, and have a great life with Jesus Christ in your life. Take good care. Bye-bye now. And remember, God does love you.